Okay. Um, have you ridden Wichita's metro system by any chance? No. <laughs> I have not ridden the Wichita metro area system, so... No. No, I haven't. I haven't either. No, I have not. Not in Wichita. No. Um, no, I haven't. Um, I mean, I have a car of my own, and so I've never used the system before. Yes, I have once. Yes. Yes. Have you used the metro system in a different city? Yes. Um, I used one in Hawaii. In Honolulu, DC, and Texas. I have. Um, I recently lived out in Western Washington in the Tacoma area. I was used to using the system out there, going around Tacoma and up into Seattle. Yeah. No, can't say I have. I've actually ridden a bus in Turkey, the country Turkey, and I've ridden trains in Chicago. But other than that, I haven't used metro system very often. Yeah, pretty much every city I've been to, from London to Paris to Montreal, which I originally come from. So uh, we have an amazing bus system and metro system. And um, it was quite a shock <laughs> coming to Wichita. I'm actually new to Wichita, three and a half months. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, Washington, D.C. has, I uh, have, Seattle. I don't know, that might be it. Yes. Oh yes. Many cities all over the world. Um, Canada, the Toronto metro system. Um, also in Paris and London and Czechoslovakia, even without speaking the language. And New York City also. What are your thoughts about the Wichita metro system? Uh, okay, well, first of all, I was looking for the metro just to find and be surprised there isn't a metro, but the buses. Uh, once I was stuck at uh, WSU, needing a ride home, and um, I, my friend indicated me that I should take the bus. So there I go, super excited. I'm like, yes, I'm going to take the bus. The bus stops. The driver, she was very, very kind, and then I meet the weirdest people there. <laughs> Um, nothing wrong with the bus, as per se, um, it's just you meet very interesting characters inside the bus. So um, I quickly understood that it's not a very safe place to be in, in a bus in Wichita. Okay. And, and also the fact that um, it, they, don't go, they don't go very often, mm -hmm. like every bus I think it's every hour and it stops at 6 or 7, this is what I've been told, mm -hmm. and that feels a little weird <laughs> coming from a bigger city. I feel like the current metro system for Wichita, Kansas is um, in need of help in the respect of um, the need for a better system and more efficient system and a system that would accommodate more people. My name is Carrie Vittush. I am a licensed clinical professional counselor. I've been um, a therapist for a little over five plus years here in Wichita, Kansas. The problem, the main problems I see is um, the timing of the system in the respect of it only runs from a certain time in the morning to a certain time at night and it only runs certain days and so therefore it makes it very difficult for people who might have a third shift or might have um, a different time period for their working or even school for that matter. Mm -hmm. um, and so it makes it very challenging for them to, to be able to commute or to be able to utilize the metro system here in Kansas, in Wichita. Um, I also feel like it is, um, it, it's very cumbersome is the best way I can explain it. Um, cumbersome in the sense of um, to go from maybe one side of the city to the other, um, it takes a very long time and it takes multiple changes in buses to get from one side of the city to another. Um, so it, it makes it very cumbersome and very difficult and um, very frustrating for people to utilize the system. 
um, which is where the efficiency part of it comes into play. Do you think the, the city should redesign the metro system where it may, makes it a little more accessible? I think so, because I think it would be used a lot more if people knew where they could go and what they could do with it. I do think that Wichita needs an updated metro system just because a lot of people either don't have a car or don't have the money to pay for gas all the time. So I think it'd be a lot more efficient to travel by metro system. I, the city doesn't really know exactly what it wants to do with its metropolitan transportation system. And as of right now, it seems like it is has some design flaws and is underutilized. I'm Dr. Sharon Eicher. I'm an associate professor of economics at Friends University. In your opinion, is Wichita in a need to invest in a more efficient metro system? That depends on what the city wants. If the city wants to have a, a system that's going to connect people so that we can reduce cars on the road and reduce costs, then it would require planning and infrastructure and probably raising people's taxes, which people would resist. Um, you could tell them that that tax increase would be offset by decreased transportation costs, but people would still resist that. So it would, it would require getting the public on board as well as political will, and that really depends on whether or not that's something people here want. I think one of t one to two things could happen. I think the morale for people um, could potentially go up because it would mean that people are interacting more and people are um, not as um, siloed is what I call it. Um, so they're not so individualized and they're not um, interacting with others, things like that. So it would, in a way, force people to interact with other people. Um, also, I think the morale in the sense of when you have a metro system, you're, you're exercising more in a respect to you're having to walk a little bit more than maybe necess than what you would normally if you were just driving. Um, at the same time, um, I think it can also cause some, some possible struggles for people to um, make that shift in, in mindset to make those to, to accept that as, as a way to do things. So that change can be very difficult for people and I think very challenging for people to make that change. Currently, we don't have the culture to support it. Does that mean that it couldn't work? Of course it could work, but we'd have to change the culture. Mm -hmm. We'd have to get people more acclimated to the idea that you can use public transportation, that it's cheap and efficient and relaxing and you don't have to go everywhere in your car. <laughs> in your expertise, uh, what is your prediction of the community when the city of Wichita does invest more in a well-efficient metro system? Um, I think it'll make Wichita look different um, in respect to um, not being so segregated which then can cause people to be um, interactive, can um, increase the um, that interaction with others that you may not always have interaction with, that you maybe wouldn't normally have interaction with. Um, because I feel like Wichita is very segregated in the respect of in areas, okay, these people are kind of in this area, these people are in this area, and if you're interacting and cross commuting with people of different races, different economic statuses, different everything, um, I think it could potentially um, increase awareness to others as well as um, potentially even improve um, how Wichita looks and and what and how it interacts with others. If the city builds a better efficient metro system, uh, would you use it more often? Oh, um, yes. yes. Definitely. I would 
use it to come to school because I pay for gas every single day driving all the way from Wichita all the way out to El Dorado and Andover. I go to both campuses and so it makes it very costly to drive myself. I think so. So it, it'd make it easier for me and, and I don't have a problem at all using metro systems like this. Absolutely. I'm, I can't wait. <laughs> Okay. Absolutely. I'm stuck right now in a situation with no car, so that would come handy. But I guess not for me, because by the time they redesign, I will probably have a car. <laughs> well, maybe. Um, right now, I mean, I do have a car and my job is here. Um, but if, you know, it depends on the situation, if I would need to use it and it was pretty successful, and then yeah, I would. I commute out to El Dorado from Wichita, so unless it ran to El Dorado, then I, I wouldn't. I don't know, I might not, but... Uh, well, maybe not in Wichita, just because it's a smaller city, you know. Okay. Um, if it was bigger... Yeah, yeah, that too. The parking's pretty decent. So. Okay. Oh, thank you very much.